I did this one song where or this one song where it was like, um, like what I wonder what people like about me, and like oh, I was well, in a bikini, so I was like boobs, right? Mm -hmm. Like because that was yeah. the that was the sound. And then I did another <laughs> one, but instead of boobs, I held up my feet. It almost got the same play. Oh yeah, like oh, the yeah. same. At this point on the internet, feet are equal in uh, desire to boobs. Right. And do you guys do you guys have any any ideas on why that is? I was just about to inquire. Do we feel like when we? Sh I mean, I guess in society, once we have memes about feet pics, does it make people actually think they like yes. feet pics and things like I that? I think. I Which think. It, I think it, those fetishes. I, I think they were already there, but I think the memeing of it maybe then, like, oh, maybe I could. Yeah, have then a spreads it. And there is uh, something. There is something about uh, I don't know feet that it's like kind of innocent, but also kind of that now they're making it sexual and taboo. So there must be some kind of thing they grab onto there. I don't know who's they. The, the feet, the feeders. No, the, the feeders. Okay. Is that what they call they're them? They're expanding their community. I've, I mean, it's, it's a community. I, I've they try and get at me. Oh, I've infiltrated <laughs> the feeders. Because I have beautiful feet. Totally infiltrated. You do. Ooh. They're long. Yeah, yeah. They're, and they're, and they got I got a high arch. Yep. Oh, the high arch. Okay. Um, so the feet yeah. are the DMs. Oh, okay, okay. The feet are very yeah. intimate, though. Like, very intimate. Like, I could have somebody rub my back before I could have somebody rub my feet. Oh, you feel like that's something kind of, oh, hey, that's mine. Like, Don't it's, touch it's something that doesn't get touched that often. Right, right. So that's a thing. Like, is it's not this touched whole often. different sensation and like I don't even know what it is to be super honest with you. They, Girls are making a lot of money. Awesome. Girls and guys, probably. Yes. Yeah. You just you oil it right. up, and mostly right. it's just it's it's wrinkly. I got feet. I got I got to share. I got to share. Goddamn. I got. No. Oh. This motherfucker. You know who you are. This motherfucker on cameo. <laughs> This motherfucker on Cameo got me. And I kind of knew, I was like, mm, mm. This, they like, they like kind of gave me like a little, because people on Cameo have asked me like, show me your feet. And I just won't do them. Because I'm like, nah, if I'm going to show you my feet, you're going to pay more than my fucking Cameo. My Cameo is like 30 bucks or something. Yeah. Um, but they like, they gave me like, a, I should have. No, they, <laughs> Dude, I charge hey. 150 a Cameo now. Good. <laughs> I am undervaluing Dude, myself. No, I'm just saying if you're gonna give me twenty eight like, after taxes. Almost everything is 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 feet. So I'm just like oh, oh so you, no yeah see so you, I would up it if I'm gonna if give you're them getting the feet. exclusively feet. Yeah. Okay. Um. But so when people just ask for feet, I don't do it. But this person, they got me, and I oh. should have known better. I should have known better. They like said something of like big fan. They gave me something else to talk about, and then, then kind of threw it away like. Hey, I have this like inside joke with my friend. If just at the end of the video, you like throw up your feet, like it's just this joke. And, and I kind of, my, I was like a little suspicious, but I was like, okay. And I even referenced it in the video. I was like, I don't know if this is what you're saying, but here. And then I think I like saw that video, like someone like shared it to me. One of these feet fetishers who gets in my DMs, like, you sent that person your feet, why can't, and I'm like, oh, mother. Now everybody wants some fucker. dead feet. Dang. You took advantage of me, you lied to me, gave me a little story Dang. that I convinced myself was real, and you got me to slut out my feet, and, and I don't feel good about it. I feel, little, I feel a little, I feel like a little, I feel like a little, I was like, you, at least like, I should have charged well, more. Honey, I should have charged honey, more. Make that money. <laughs> yeah, like it's not even all. my cameo's cheap, man. It wasn't make, it wasn't enough. You didn't my love, really, do not undervalue yourself, nor my nor, sexy feet. Yeah, nor your parts. Hmm. Dang. Nor never again, motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, Unless man. I agree to it, I didn't feel I didn't feel good about them tricking me into it. That that felt, felt I felt violated. Now, do you yeah. take care of your feet? Mm -mm. Uh, yeah, they, no they barely exist. Yeah, I, ba I just have a lower <laughs> leg. Yeah. I barely know they exist. Yeah, no, yeah. I mean, wow. I like to be barefoot often. Like I have like Love I have barefoot. like dirty like feet because I'm barefoot. Like they're like black on the bottom. I don't mm. even notice. I heard someone say you're supposed to like scrub your feet in the shower. Oh, you like cleanse you? No, I mean they're at the bottom where all the soap ends up. Yeah, but so, like, oh, just I don't even it touch them. Ooh, no. I barely touch them. Do a crusty thing. I don't even touch them. Do you know what I mean? No. Look. <laughs> It's like a wound after a while. Like you got, you got to, got to. It's like self care. Do you guys know how good it feels to take care of your feet? Oh, there's, babe, there's though. There's a reason. I, I, like, <laughs> like no, I shower. That's what I meant. Oh, yeah, like a foot spa. It is an oh, erogenous, no. like oh, very. No, it feels amazing to get a foot rub and all those things. It, I just, don't, I'm not doing it often. Yeah. Right. 
I'm one of those guys I, who I would recommend foot baths for you both. It makes you feel like a king. Even the pedicures are tough for me. When 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 what? like a, when a woman like you know when never the lady's like using the thing. You've never gotten one. No. Nope. With the lady, yeah, she's gonna I've grab her feet. a pedicure or a man. You're gonna laugh I will take the whole you for time. One. I would. Can love we to. go? Yeah, I would love to. I've never done it. I've just never done it. Oh just go my get heart. Those, okay, <laughs> only stipulation. Love to get you need to paint your toes a color, which is Great. not going to be a problem. Not a problem. Not a problem. Not a problem. Yeah. Yeah. not a problem for you? No, I've done the clear. If we could do a Manny Petty and we just paint it all up. A manly Manny. Right? Manny, would you do, yeah. would you do a color? No, I'm okay. more of a Yeah. Yeah, I'm more Emphatic clear. Emphatic no. Yeah. But no. yo, honestly, I, wouldn't die, I would but. like that would be such an experience because truly it's like I, I can't explain the kind of relaxation no. it is and like the care. Like, I get that. No, like, it tickles. Like it's, it's gonna be rough. If, oh, especially if you haven't had your feet Terrible. Touched, I am, yeah, I'm like, I am pretty, but I've learned to get through it. Yeah. I giggled the whole time. Yeah. 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 I'm in. I mean, it sounds I'm totally down. To like yeah. I've just never. Yep. The oh. pumice stone, bro. Yo, when you get it's the crazy. callus remover, it has. It's like this cheese grater thing. That thing gets so full. And you're just like, how Ooh. did I even walk before? Wait, wait, wait. No, the calluses smooth, are, I like my calluses. But the smoothness of Okay. I feel proud of my calluses. You, you They're know, helping you know, me walk around I like a hobbit. Yeah, understand, yeah. but if you ever just like wanted a little cleanup, I mean like a callus forever, your foot's gonna like fall off, it's so dense and like, you know what I mean? It's like so much callus. I'll do it for fun, it sounds it's lovely. It's like turns to glass, yeah. So um, it'll be great. I need it too. Last summer with Scott Plimpton, our old studio teacher, yeah. Oh, um, you did the Scott had this goal. He was turning 50. He wanted to walk 50 miles on his 50th birthday. And he uh, invited me. He asked if I wanted to join this challenge and Theo. And uh, I was like, yeah, that sounds fucking awesome. I was like, 50 miles is a lot, but it's just yeah. walking. It's fine. I was like, I can do that. I'm young. I'm healthy. I work out. I'm fucking, I got this. And then he called and he was like, hey, um, so you guys are going to need to do a, a gut check uh, to make sure you really want to do this. He, he said, because I just did half. I just did 25 miles. He's like, and I'm dying. <laughs> um, and so uh, over a summer, we were training to walk I 50 miles. I went once miles. with you guys. Daniel came yeah. with us for uh, like a 12-mile walk in mm -hmm. Malibu. Um, we got to, mm -hmm. the longest walk we got to was 31 miles uh, in 10 hours. And that shit was some of the most pain I've ever felt. Like the dull pain in the bottom of your feet from walking yeah. for that long. Like there was such beauty in it, like just going on long walks. And we live in California, yeah. so we're walking oh, yeah. Scenery uh, on the coast, yeah. like beautiful. There's like long yeah. boardwalks all the way down the coast. It was gorgeous, but 31 miles walking, my feet were destroyed. Wow. Yeah. But I was proud of those calluses, God damn it. That freaks <laughs> me out. Like people, like, like everything we hear about just, you know, torturous walks and yeah. it, it was oh. it was it was kind of torture. And Scott, uh, eventually, we had to like back and just off the any challenge. any that was even the settler who had to like make it across. You know, any Bro. I mean, that's just woo. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. It was prime. Um. Anyways, we're here to review an episode. We're here to. <laughs> and what do you say there? Um. It's an episode called dances. 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 And yes. enough about one of my favorite things is when Jim J. Bullock. He's up, there he's up there DJing. Yeah, he was going in. Did you watch this I episode? I did. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I did when we made it. Oh. Um, I watched it on Look, cold. you guys, I, they, they will be covered next time. That was my bad. Okay. Honestly, if your Netflix could have been working. Um, well, the thing was. What's up with that, The thing dude? was, I tried, to, I tried to get you to watch it right before we filmed. Right. On the Netflix that, was the plan. that I use on my laptop, uh -huh. which is not my own Netflix. It's kind of a fan that I know through Instagram, and it's her Netflix, and she happened to be watching at the same time. So, Allison, you were watching Gilmore Girls, and I couldn't show Lindsay this episode oh. to prep for this podcast. So, you Netflix and chilled with a fan? No, no. And now you have the. No, no, oh, never. No, okay. uh, oh. no, no. I was on location. <laughs> on, I was on location on a movie. Okay. And I don't have Netflix. And I just like. Uh, just put on my story. Anyone got an account I can use? Oh, and this kind soul. Allison, did Allison, you get a lot of them or only one? I think I got a couple. I got a couple requests. So yeah. future use guys, if you yeah. ever need a hundred Allison, you're not the 100%. only one apparently. Right. But I got I got in there, and then my computer has never logged out of it. So that's the Netflix I use on my computer. Nice. Wow. At home, I use a different fan. No, right. Right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, but anyway, dances. You didn't get to see it because Allison, you were watching Golden Girls. Golden Girls. Gilmore, Gilmore Girls. Girls. <laughs> <laughs> Allison, you're uh 75 years old. Um. 
You don't got to be 75 to watch Gilmore. Or, I mean, Golden Girls. Golden no, that's true. That's true. I that's love Golden Girls. You do have to be Gilmore, yeah. Gilmore Girls. We have a lot of that stuff goes right over Rose head. and Blanche? Um, what's up, guys? Thank you for watching this episode of Ned's Declassified Podcast Survival Guide. If you can't get enough of us, we got clips over on the Podco YouTube channel. You can check them out there. And if you really can't get enough of us, we got a ton of extra content and live streams and live Q&As on Patreon. And that helps support this podcast and, and help us keep going and make it possible. So we love you for that. Uh, check out the links in the description. And uh, thanks for tuning in.